Oh, it's a butthole. It's a butthole and we're going straight in. Hello everybody, my name is Jared and welcome to Jared Gaming. Welcome back to the Dreadx Collection Volume 2. Last time we played, we played a sucker for love. We were a poor soul who was trying to seek the affection of an eldritch god only to find the end of reality. So let's dive right back into this creepy house of horrors and find out what is in store next. Okay, so we need to find another key. Now there is a key in this clock and I imagine this table of tools has something to do with that. Well, let us see what this says here. We removed his tongue to save ourselves from judgment. We removed his eyes to save him from witnessing what we were becoming. Hmm. At four and seven. Yes, indeed. And we have ourselves another key. What video shall we investigate next? I think I will choose Undiscovered by Torpal Duke because they are also one of my favorite indie horror developers. A cursed tomb of kings lies hidden deep in the ancient jungle. Explore the tomb, learn its secrets, and find what lies undiscovered. Sounds interesting indeed. Come to me, VHS. I have plans for you. Undiscovered. Here we go. There are some very disturbing sounds coming from this game already. No time like the present. Let us begin. Oh. Select character. We have male or female. Does it matter? United States of America Department of Mysteries. Is this an actual department? I think not, but... Status classified. Top secret. The following footage was recovered from a handheld film camera on Earth on August 27, 1956, near a small village in Northern Redacted. The camera was estimated to have been buried for at least a decade, though the film itself was still intact. Expeditions to find the locations depicted on the film reel have so far been fruitless. Several search teams have even failed to return and are considered KIA. The following footage is the recovered contents of that camera. Hmm. Interesting. All right, is it on? Are you recording? Yep, we're good. Okay, good. Ahem. <clears throat> Hello there, my name is Dr. Marty Williams, and I'm an archaeologist as well as a professor of Asian cultures. I'm here today at a newly uncovered archaeological site somewhere in the jungles of South America. To my knowledge, I'm the first person to set foot on this location since the indigenous people who built it roughly a thousand years ago. Since this site is completely untouched, I have brought along a video camera to document its entire exploration. To this end, I have brought along my ever trusty and faithful assistant, not to mention wife, hello, Janet, to film my every step as my personal camera crew. I'm just as excited to be here as you are, Marty, and I'm, and may I say, you look great on camera. Thank you, dear. Yes, well, with the introductions out of the way, let discovery begin. Yeah. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go. Right now. Oh. What? Oh. Oh, crap. Oh, this is so cool. This is freaking awesome. What a cool idea to play in third person from the perspective of the person who's filming. That is brilliant. Oh. Oh, this. Oh. Are we just going? Are we just going in? I guess we're just going in. Oh, that is so cool, though. Incredible. These ruins are positively ancient. Imagine the kinds of things that may lie undiscovered here. And the money we'll be making after publishing our findings on them. Now we're talking. It's all about the money. There's no sense of, there's no passion for exploration, no interest in the, the unknown. Wow, what a view. This is why I wanted to bring the camera along to capture it. Orange alone wouldn't do it justice. Indeed. Ooh, that's really cool. This is so freaking cool. Can I run? I don't think I can run. Look, there's a note over there, a note. But aren't we the first people here since this place was built? As far as I'm aware, yes. Who could have left you here then? In our conquest in the name of the Emperor of Spain, my unit has occupied a nearby village in search of gold and glory. The villagers told us of a nearby ancient tomb that sounds ripe for plundering. 
They also mentioned that the tomb is cursed and is forbidden for anyone to enter. Ridiculous! The superstitions of the locals never fail to amuse. We shall enter the tomb as soon as we can. I like that this is a note written by a Spaniard of the Empire of Spain, and it's written in English. Simply incredible. This site was originally discovered by Spanish conquistadors. Why haven't we had this before? Surely this would have been written about in the history books. No idea, but we must investigate further. Maybe we'll find the answers we seek. Maybe we'll find some untold horrors. I knew that Torpal Duke would not disappoint. This is super cool. I like how all the torches are also lit. This must be a tomb of Skyrim. Are we not going to make a comment on that? Is there a person down there? No, I think it's a skeleton. I really like this perspective. It is, however, a little disorienting. <laughs> this is very shaky as if someone's, you know, using a camera. That's a big skeleton. Ooh. Tombs. Tombs, skeleton. Wow. This place is incredible. Indeed, this is the most intact sight I've ever seen. Let's see what mystery she holds. Hi. Hi there. That is a very large skeleton. Let's see, what do we have? We have more we oh we have more notes. How perfect. More Spanish conquistadors? We have entered the tomb and have thus far seen no sign of any curse. We are protected by God himself. No curses, imaginary or otherwise, could ever do us harm. Regrettably, we have yet to find any of the gold we were promised by the captain. But he assures us that it must have been hidden further in the tomb. Yes, indeed. Can we take this sword? Can we have that sword that, or any of these weapons? That would be really freaking great. These statues are so realistic. Excellent craftsmanship. What are you talking about? Are you talking about the giant skeletons? Well, there's certainly a plenty of reference material. Yeah, this place is full of old skeletons. Kinda creepy. It's a tomb. What did you expect? Skeletons? But not giant skeletons. Okay, I don't think there's anything down here. That's, oh, look, we can only go up, it would seem. More passageways lit by a burning torch. Gosh, another skeleton. Is this one bigger than the other ones? A race of giants lived here. That's one big skeleton. Were ancient people really that big? Looks like it was made of stone. Another one of those statues. Don, I was hoping we discovered the land of giants. Yes. Yes, Janet, I wish we had as well. I have a feeling we have discovered something far greater. Let us read the note. We have still not found an ounce of gold in this ghastly place. As we began to raise our concerns to the captain, we heard sounds coming from behind the wall. We inspected a couple of conspicuous torches and behold, there is a hidden passage behind it. One of the villagers must have heard of our coming and moved all of the gold even deeper underground. We will find this savage and show him how we deal with those who stand in the way of the Empire. Ah, looks like the tomb goes even deeper than we thought. I don't see any secret passages here though. Maybe do what the note said. Pull the torches, dude. Now would it be very secret if it were obvious, would it? Let's keep looking around. Maybe we can find these conspicuous torches. These tools must have been left behind by the previous occupants. Let's take them, they might turn out to be useful. Press Q to equip or unequip the torch. Press R with the torch equipped to light objects in front of you. Oh, we have torch. We have torch. Am I supposed to light, what am I supposed to light on fire? What do you think, would a sword make a good souvenir? Yes, I don't know, wouldn't that count as grave robbing? Only a little bit, but not if we don't tell anyone. <laughs> Just leave it, besides we're the only living things in here. It's not like we're going to be attacked by monsters or something. Why the hell, Janet, would you say such a thing? Ooh, a cave. A hole in the wall. I guess we're going in. Oh my. Oh, it's dark. But there's torches that I think we can light. These torches, hmm, these torches look pretty conspicuous to me. I agree. Why do you say we light them and see what happens? I sure as soon as we find something to light them with, I've got a torch in my hand, Janet. Open your eyes. Ah! Oh! Yeah, I thought I lit my head on fire for a second. Okay, another one. Let's light... Oh, dear. I'm just going to go into the wall for a second. I was not expecting that. Janet, stay close. Things are about to get weird. Amazing! A secret passage into a cave system. It looks man-made. I wonder what they would have used this tunnel for. 
It sure is dark. Yes, but don't be afraid. More discoveries await. Ha <laughs> ha. We may run into a rat or two, Ralph, but I trust we can hold our own against the likes of them. If you say so. Hmm. I have the feeling we're going to run into something much worse than rats. Ooh, it's so shaky. This reminds me of a dream I once had. I walked down an endless tunnel, alone for what felt like hours. It was horrible. Did you ever get to the end? Oh no, I was eventually killed by some unseen presence in the darkness. Then I woke up. Janet, you need to shut up now. Lovely. You really need to sh shut the hell up. Why would you say that? Look what we're doing. Oh, a dead end. Huh? A dead end? That doesn't make any sense. But check out the wall. Doesn't it look too sturdy? Ah, uh, this may be a jump of my trusty pickaxe. Stand back, honey. Let me see what this thing can do. Let's light this torch first so that we have light while we work. And pick away. Ooh! Hurry, get the torch back. Hmm. There's something down there. Something glows. Oh, another note. What a weird place to have a note. We've discovered that the tomb connects to a natural cave. It goes on much wider and deeper than we had imagined. So Sanchez was ordered to map out our surroundings as we go. We still have not caught sight of the thief we are after. But we have heard more sounds in the cave. Sometimes they are like growls or groans. Others like the voice of a man indistinguishable in the echo of the cave. Sometimes though they come as a whisper. Not to the ear, but seemingly to the mind. I have begun to dislike this place. And may soon tell the captain that we should head back. Oh, this does not sound good. This does not bode well for us. If the conquistadors were afraid, we should probably be afraid as well. Let's just keep going. Oh, it's so dark. Ooh. Oh, that's just... Oh. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What? What do, you, what do you see, Janet? What do you see? Oh, they're just statues. Thank goodness. Did you think that they weren't? Did you think they were real skeletons? No, no, it's just not something you want to see in the dark. This must have been the storage closet for statues. <laughs> what an interesting conclusion to come to. <laughs> I wonder why they made so many skeletons, though. I wonder when we can turn around and leave. I'm with Janet now. Finally the smartest thing she said. Turning around and leaving. But no, we'll venture forward. One of these has come into life. I just know it. It's like a game where there's mannequins. Even if they're not moving, you know eventually one of them will come to life and try to murder you. Okay, something's down at the end here. It's really freaking dark. Let's get some of these torches lit. What the devil is that? I don't know, I can't see. You're in the way. Janet's hiding behind me now. It looks like another one of those statues. It is it wearing armor. I don't think we should go near it. Is it a conquistador? Oh, that scared the crap out of me because I couldn't see him. He seemingly came out of nowhere. Oh! What? Oh, we get another chance? What am I supposed to do? Am I just supposed to not approach him? He doesn't seem to move any closer to me. He's guarding this way. Oh, crap. Oh crap, is he coming after me? I don't know where I'm going now. Can I go around him? Haha, <laughs> you stupid idiot. It's another one of those conquistadors. Oh, what's that to him anyway? This one's not walking. Strange. Why is the skeleton not reanimated like the other? Look, there's a note next to him. Let's read it. The other one's not too smart, though, so... Sanchez went crazy and attacked his own comrades, ranting something about the new god. We were forced to put him down. Unfortunately, his map was destroyed in the mayhem. We have begun to search for the way back to the surface, but some of us fear we may not make it. Well, this must be Sanchez that answers that question. How bizarre. The new god. The dark must have gotten to him. Can I light this? Okay, easy. Easy, dude. I'm just lighting the torch. Just lighting the torch, dude. Take it easy. You good. <laughs> you good, man. Don't worry. I ain't here to hurt you, bro. Oh, he's coming for me. He's coming for me! Do I need to pickaxe through this door, maybe? Or through this wall? Indeed we do. Alright, let's just keep going deeper. What's the worst that can happen, right? 
Oh crap. Move, Janet, move. There's another one, damn it. Maybe I lower him out to his friend and they'll fight. Oh crap, I'm getting stuck on stalagmites. Run! No! Oh god. Oh. 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 This is not good. Run! Run! Oh! Oh, I'm out of here. Haha! <laughs> idiot, you're too slow. You're too slow, you idiot. Alright, I think it's time to get the hell out of here. I don't know what else to do. Onward, Janet, we must escape. I don't know, is this new? Oh, I think this is new. What kind of place is this? It's ridiculous. Perhaps they're traps to deter thieves. Maybe the bottom of the pillar doesn't look too stable, but you could destroy it with your pickaxe. Ah, yes, I believe you're right. Let's find out, shall we? Yeah, let's destroy this place. <laughs> Yay! Stay close, Janet. Do not fall. Do not fall. Oh, God. I think this is the last one. But the last one to what, though? Hey, guys. What's up, dudes? Another note? How did they get over here without taking the pillars down? In our search for a way out, we have decided to venture deeper into the cave to see if there were another path to the surface. The walls have changed from cold stone to a stinking, slimy, flesh-like material. What kind of cave is this? Some fear that we have descended into hell itself. We have become separated in the darkness. At first I could only hear... At first I could hear my comrades calling out, but the walls have drowned out any sound. And I am not totally alone. I think sometimes about Sanchez raving about our new god and wonder if there was some truth in his madness. Poor chap. Sounds like all the marauding conquistadors lost their minds wandering blindly down here. Just kind of like what we're doing. But what did he mean by flesh-like material? No idea. But I imagine we're going to find out soon enough. Oh, look. A cave of flesh-like material. Oh, it's a butthole. It's a butthole and we're going straight in. What the... I guess that's what he meant. <laughs> no, no shit, Janet. Wrong. Maybe I shouldn't use that terminology. What kind of place is this? I don't know. I don't like it. <laughs> oh my! Well, that's, that is disorienting. I'm getting, I'm getting Ocarina of Time vibes. Ooh, another note. What a perfect spot for another note. I feel that I will meet my doom down here alone in the dark, with my comrades surely lost beyond all hope. I cannot stop thinking about the new god, or rather, I cannot stop thinking about me. I feel a presence peering into the cracks of my mind. This is either a work of one true god, or the devil himself. We shall see which greets me as I wander these halls. Great. Fantastic! Ow! Ow! What do I do? You can't hit me! Ah! Oh my god! Oh! Janet, run! Oh! Oh! We're deeper. Oh god. At least I know they're really slow at attacking now. I have seen it. Glorious is the new god. I wish to never leave its side. I shall protect it from any that seek to disturb its homes and its slumber. Praise be to him. Great. Do I have to... We are being watched, it would seem. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, I... Apparently, we were all speechless. Well, well, this must be the new God we've heard so much about. What do we do now? Looks like we're trapped in here. I can't stand being under its gaze. I've got to do something about it, like maybe burn it with the torch. Like what? All you have is a torch! Indeed I do. And a torch is all I need. Die, you bastard! <laughs> oh, we did it! He did not protect him! He did a really bad job of protecting him! Ha! Take that! Ha <laughs> ha, you stupid eyeball! Oh, lordy. Oh, good. Where are we going? down here? I can't tell. This is crazy. <laughs> Wait, do you hear something? 
Huh? Uh oh. Oh! What? Marty, no! Why would that happen out of nowhere? Get out of here! While you can! No! Not without you! It's too late for me! Go! Marty, no! Oh! 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 Oh, we're in first person now. Oh, what a, what a, what a divergence. Oh, sight! Crap, 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 crap! Just keep moving. They're slow as hell. Just keep moving. Oh, God. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. You couldn't protect your God. And you can't defeat me. Oh, this is so weird. We're, are we just going to get impaled, too? I mean, what's to stop that from? The walls have changed back to normal here. Maybe that means I'm close to a way out. Oh, I seriously doubt it. I can't believe Marty will be lost in there. But the loss will not be in vain. Once I escape, I'll publish our findings and make... Once I escape, I'll publish our findings and make sure the world knows what happened here. How we... No. How I... Discovered a god. World leaders will lust for its power, and only I know where to find it. I'll make a fortune selling to the highest bidder. I just need to escape first. <laughs> what? Janet became... Corrupted, maybe? Hey, excuse me. Can you help me out? I don't know, I can't tell. It's really hard to see. Oh, it's such a dark and horrible maze. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, ooh. Is that... Is that a way out? I'm almost out of this hellish place. Just a little further. Oh, are you gonna be that easy? I think I've lost control. Nope. Okay. Even though I... I'm not sure... I'm not really happy with the way Janet has become, but I'm ready to get the heck out of this place. I still wish I could run. What? No! No! Oh! I'm in the creature! And it ate me. It's so dark in here. The air is so heavy, so warm, so beautiful. Praise the new god. Oh! Couple's goals? Oh my. Well, there you have it. That is Undiscovered by Torpal Duke. Very, very strange. Really cool perspective. A little, if not a little disorienting, but really freaking cool. Um, I love Torpal Duke, and I love this. A great addition to Dread X, in my opinion. Hope you guys enjoyed this as well. If you did, please leave a like and leave a comment. As always, I cannot wait to play more of this collection. It, these game, Every single game I've played so far has been really well done. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. And as always, you've been awesome. Let's play again soon, and I'll see you in the next video.